Now to a story first on seven, a man shot and killed right outside his South Florida business. Seven's Lorena Estrada is live in the Plex with more on his son, who is now opening up, Lorena. That's right, Alex. His son says his father was closing for the day when he was ambushed this morning. He is demanding justice. This Miami neighborhood on edge after a deadly robbery on 12th Avenue and 5th Street Friday evening. Walter Casinada, the owner of this Boost Mobile, was shot and killed in front of his store. Surveillance video from a business across the street captures his final moments. In the corner, you can see two men struggling. Then watch closely. A man wearing an orange hoodie fires a gun at Castaneda before running off with a small bag. Castaneda fired back as the shooter hops in a white sedan and speeds away. Walter Castaneda Jr. thinks his father was targeted. He was closing the store and it seems like some individuals were waiting in the car for him across the street. Surveillance video from the Boost Mobile shows a car pulling up. This is the car. This is the car. The store attendant saying this is the car. Castaneda Jr. believes someone in that car knew his father had just put the store's weekly earnings in the bag that was stolen. I don't know how, how they knew that they had uh, he had money, um, his small bag, his lunch bag. That Friday night, the grandfather of six was looking forward to a weekend with family. This happening all after he just strapped two grandkids into their car seats. Those kids eventually finding their grandfather lying on the ground. They said it was one in the, in, the, in the stomach and the other one was at the rib. And it seems like destroyed him and he passed away. Castaneda wants the shooter caught and to see more Miami police patrolling the area. We just need more security around, around this area for how people to work. And if you have any information that can help in the investigation, you're urged to call police.